Welcome back to Dimension Trading. This is JT. This channel is to dedicate help the trader like you to improve your trading skill in seven days. We are going to show you how to identify your trading style, the risk and reward that you can take, and the trading style for how long you are going to use, which is scalping, midterm, or long-term swing trade. And right now, we are going to review what we have done so far on this week for the trade and uh, for a quick update of one of the uh, star pick we just scanned a while ago uh, let's begin for this week we got a winner on the ticket ske which we found the hammer down in our down in our and for our area along with the trend line and we are aiming for the dimension zone number four which is a resistance right here and the pricing enter according to what we are playing on the resistance zone area for the dimension two pricing shooting up right away in the day hitting our target on 513 so this is the first winner we got on this week Let's go to the other pairs that we have currently open. In the ticket CIA, we are removing our risk from our stop. We are removing our risk from stop to the entry already because pricing moving in our favor to our target one. We are expecting pricing moving to our uh dimension zone number four all the way to here where is the day trend line all the way down here that is the reasonable area we take the profit which is almost one to four reward and pricing so far is moving quite well to our direction along with the trend line with a hammer as we recognize along the zone with a support which is dimension two. So CIA is a pair we are still holding on the upside. Next one, OMER. This pair we picked yesterday, we got entry. We got entry right here, but pricing is right now kind of against us a little bit, but haven't hit our stop nor breaking out the downtrend line because we got a big tail of the hammer from here. So it's okay to hold to see if next week can moving up, then we can remove our risk to our entry to at least break even before we can see any further up movement. So this pair is still holding position without any changes. The next one, PSQH. We found the hammer right around uh, this area. This is a hammer that we recognize when pricing moving back right here. And pricing create another rejection right here along with the trend line where our entry is around this area. Our stop is down here. Right now pricing is a little against us. So similar to the OMER, and pricing is still on the top of the option trend line. It's okay. We are uh, kind of be patiently waiting to see if the pricing can uh, moving similarly to the OMER, so we can remove our stop to our entries. Uh, on the top side, the four hour trend line with the demand zone number four is our reasonable target. So if the pricing moving our favor, the first uh, resistance we are expecting probably is going to be right here, which is one to two, and uh, we can move in slowly to up to almost one to four or one to five reward up here if we just keep in moving our stop along with the price. So our first priority is be patient holding the pair as long as the price is moving to our target one or even down here, we can move our risk to the entry. All right, now the favorite part. We just scan our scanner and found a new setup in 
A R C O. This pair is forming a hammer right at the train line, and in an hour and four hour after the train line, and along with the support right here after they break the downtrend train line. So this is the dimension two continuation pattern, which is break and uh, testing the support. Our entry is open right at uh, 11.09. According to the four hour downtrend resistance zone, where is the dimension four area, our reasonable target will be 11 dollars 80 cents which is bring our risk and reward one two four correction sorry one two three all right all right if you take one thing or two this week please feel free to subscribe share like comment below and uh, we'll come back for you in a new pickup next week have a great weekend